How cool is this? This just happened. Like last night. He's just relaxing. Good morning, everyone. I'm going to make some keto coffee and I'm going to attempt to uh, make an omelet. So this should be fun. Let's figure it out. Oh yeah, let's get our weight real quick. One ninety five even. <sighs> yes. Well, that didn't go well. Shape. Well, it didn't turn out perfect. I kind of messed up that side of it, but for the most part, it was a success, right? My eyes are always hungrier than I actually am. Thank God. Uh, before keto, though, I would have definitely ate all of that plus more. Um, I'm going to save that to have for lunch so I don't have to make anything and I know it's going to be keto friendly and good. But I am going to finish my keto coffee. By the way, that omelet tastes amazing. I love it. Absolutely love it. Time to get some keto stuff, right guys? Right, Jackson? Yes. Man, this is definitely gonna be delicious. So I put some uh, Meltdown Keto in this cup because the can was kind of messed up. Um, seven ounces of the hamburger meat mixed with some onions and jalapenos. So I just like embedded it and met it into it. I put two pieces of uh, sharp cheddar cheese and that's two slices of bacon on top of there. And I splashed just a little bit of grease on there to melt it and add a little bit of fat to it. Cut up ribeye with some salad and a water. That's what dinner should look like everyone. All right guys, that's the end of the day. Made some fat bombs, made some good food today. I had some awesome food today to say the least. I just finished the most intense workout I think I have done all year. It was 90 minutes full body workout. The only thing I didn't do is lats and forearms and abs. But uh, all the other muscle groups I just straight crushed. I'll put that uh, you know that workout in the description. Do it. Let me know if you like it. Uh, but anyway, I skipped yesterday, so I had to, you know, go extra hard today, and I got, I don't know, I just got that feeling in me. Sometimes when you get in the gym, you just go ham. 
I don't know. I hope you guys go to the gym. I love the gym. It's it's definitely therapeutic to say the least. But um, so tonight I'm not going to drink anything crazy. I'm just going to do two tablespoons of coconut oil. So that's my fats for the end of the day. Um, instead of just mixing up, you know, different things and all that. And, you know, that was no carbs, no protein, just fat. Uh, so it was 28 grams to be exact uh, with that specific coconut oil. But um. Tomorrow we are going to test something. I'm not going to tell you what it is. We're going to test something tomorrow morning and we're going to see if it's keto friendly. I have a feeling it isn't just because of what's in it, but I don't ever see anybody talking about it. So I'm going to talk about it. And that's kind of what I'm trying to do is trying to find things that other people haven't done and do them for you because we need to know these things because if you're going to drink energy drinks and stuff like that, you need to know if they're keto friendly or not. But anyway, my arm is giving out on me because it is completely exhausted from my workout. And I'm going to let you go on this one. I'm going to talk to you tomorrow. Until then, keep it keto. I mean...